morning. Okay, guys, let's do a breath. Let's do this half an hour hit. Okay, let's keep our shoulders down and 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. This bend was five, four, three, two, and one. And then just take it in front and I'm going to stop that right in there. Through the hip. So one, two, three, four, go the other way, four, three, two, one, and the other side. Let's go. One, two, three. Recommendation, join the warm up. And to see when you're only film on side, back to black. It was so good. Don't listen to the critics. And then go into a wide stance. Take your hands behind your back. Squeeze the scapula together. Chin to chest. Bottom back. Just gently forward. Take your gaze up. Chin down. And then all the way. And just try and get your hands a little bit higher if that feels comfortable. Take a breath in. Take both hands down to the bottom, onto the floor, have a little rock, forward and back, for three, two, one, and then start walking the feet in, and gently reset the spine back up to a lower up. Beautiful. Let's just warm up through the hip, through the shoulders. Oh, nice. Three, four, four more. Four, three, two. So I've not decided if I'm doing much jumping today or just a nice fast one. And one. Well done. Okay, so we're going to get started actually. So shoulders down. Let's just warm up everything down and then opposite hand to me for 20. 10 each side, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10 each side, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and one, one more minute from the hamstrings, hips back, 10 wood shots. Just today, cold but beautiful and bright. Hold, 
Straight into a long downward dog. Take the heels towards the floor. Then back. Fire up the bum. Take your left foot, point it, push the mat away, round the shoulders a little bit, lift for 10, for 9, for 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hold the other side, keep pushing away, rounding at the shoulders, taking the scapula apart. 10, the other side, 10, 9, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good. Hold. And we just come down into a forearm plank. Firing up the core. Gaze down. Down, gently down. Oh, beautiful. Do you know what, guys? I think I'm going to turn this into an advanced Pilates class. <laughs> okay, let's come on to your back. Sometimes you have to listen to your body, and your body wants strength and precision today. So lengthen through the collarbones. Walk the feet a little bit closer to your bottom. Lift up. I don't often do advanced Pilates on. Um, video. So walk the shoulders down, draw the belly in so you feel strong and just take the hands on the hips for a second, take the other leg up, hands down and we're going to take it for 20, one side, 19, don't let the hip drop. breath in, slowly lower, one by one, and back again, the older we get, the strength has become so much more important, tuck, lift, one, two, three, four, five, you can take hands back if you want, I prefer them down, Okay, let's go into some abdominal work. So let's take one leg high, the other leg low. Make sure the tummy is engaged, make sure you're not arching through the back. So send the lower back towards the floor on this one, elbows out wide. Lift.
away, took the tailbone, not the tailbone, took the ribcage in and down. Well done, take a little squeeze in. Good. Let's roll over onto our side. Let's do some of the leak work. Okay, so, so I've got the acceleration. Draw the tummy in, come into a half C curve like that. Yeah? So a half C curve, hands in prayer, keep that navel to spine connected. Lift up if you can, if it's too much, take them down. Take it 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. So if it's too much, down. 5, 4, you feel a bit stable, your feet down. 3, Taking you please, the lower back muscles of motif. Take it well. One. Beautiful. Reach forward. Gently back. Come on back down. Take it into insurance. Reach the calf. Three. To the side. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Make sure on each side. One, two. Keep the chin to chest. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Four. Oh, I can't feel my abdominals. I wish you don't do enough abs at the minute because I can't feel them. And then we're going to come into double leg lows. Go easy. You can put your hands behind your head if you want, chin to chest, just to protect the neck a little bit. Draw the belly in, push the lower back into the mat. Lower, do not let the tummy down. Don't do that. Yeah? Lower. Back up. Don't like double edge, you can just do scissor like that. Push the lower back into the mat, lower as much as you can. Hold. Lower. Keep pushing the lower back into the mat. Lower. Lower. And in. Take a nice breath in. Roll around. Our abdominals are capable of much more than we think. Oh, hands out, take a little supine spine. Now we're going to do some abdominals on the front. So we're going to take it into 
a downward dog here. So like this. We're going to take one leg up, the other leg down, and bring it forward to make eyes. And then raise it again and bring it in. Yeah, so up, down, raise, full into plank. Up, down, raise. Hold it, push the mat away, round the shoulders, in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Back the other side. Up, down, nice calf stretch, lift, in. Sixteen. Two. to the mat. You can double up the mat on your knees if you want. The knees fit good for me. Like this. Well obviously that they are for me. And we're going to take the hands either side of the mat. Neck nice and long. Take it down for five, four, three, two, one. Back again. Five, four, three, Two, one, back, two more, five, four, three, two, one, back, last ones, five, four, three, two, one, back, stay in. Standing position. Okay. Let's take some weights first. Okay, I'm just gonna do first lunge bicep curl nice and quick. One, ten each side. Two, three, four, five. And the back knee, six. to full sumo squat, pull back second position, keep the shoulders down, squeeze the scapula, Standing, but wood chop, retract up, nice and quick. Last one, ten. Have a 
besar. Feet together, lift up, scissor. One well done the other side. Work on down. I'm just going to take a little stretch. Then we're going to work a little bit faster. Head it up. Just to burn that final five, seven minutes. A few old favourites, guys. So six signature hip moves, guys. Just time one, maybe 30 on 10 off or so. Just for the last bit. Okay, so we're going to start with jumping squats. Three, hang on, I'm going to wait for the clock. Two, let's go. 30 seconds. Three. 
and out. Second into parallel. Three, two, one, go. to do that or run it with me. Let's go, only third, last third. Yeah, yeah. The other side. Back. Chin to chest. at minute so let's just take our neck side to side forward and back 
the sound, which just come from this in the neck, try and mobilize every day. Holding around. Then turn your body in one direction, chin to chest, hips back, just roll down to open up the opposite side. And take some deep inhales. Out through the mouth. In. the other side. Chin to chest, hips back, gently down. Breath in, out, in, out, last one, gently up. Just a nice calf stretch. So it's good if you want to go into a walk. Take the back leg, really drive the heel into the mat. Hold. In this position, you can lengthen the leg a bit more. Bend the knee, just reach up. Tuck in the tailbone to stretch the back, well, the front of the back leg, the quads. And back into just a quick calf again. Last one. Calf. Then from the back leg, down, tuck the tailbone. Yeah, so like that from that angle. Yay. And then back again, back down, or the other one. And if you've got a bath at home, which you probably haven't, it's nice to do this. If not, then just pull back. And now stay. Thanks guys, have a fabulous day.